we're going to talk about mass and weight. So we're going to differentiate the, weight, the mass and the weight, and we'll try to um, find their relationship with respect to each other. Okay. So if we say mass, so mass is defined as the absolute the absolute quantity quantity of matter found in an object okay so that is mass can we see weight so it's just have weight in the polar Weight. So weight is defined as the force of gravity acted on the object. Okay, so we have here the, the definition of uh, mass and weight. So we could see now their, their defense. So mass is the absolute quantity of matter found in an object, while the weight is force. So the force of gravity acted on the objects. So if you are going to we are going to analyze the units so if the unit for mass so it's unit so for the MTS so MTS this will be in kilogram for CGS that will be grams and for FPS so that will be pound mass. Now for um, weight, so let's have weight for this one. So for weight, so the unit for weight in MTS, so this will be because this weight is a force, so this will be Newton. For CGS, this will be dyne, and for FPS, so this will be pound dots, or we could say um, pound force. So this is the difference of the two: their definition and their unit. But if we are going to get the relationship. space for our discussion so if you are going to have the relationship so by definition so weight is equal to the amount of gravity so that is the amount of gravity so we could say that uh, our gravity is uh, g acted on a object so the object can be described by its mass so we have this formula so weight is equal to mass times j now if we will remember the definition so weight is a force so therefore this is f let's just put that one here below so this is f Okay, so this is mass of obviously. Now, how, what relationship or what law or concept that we could transform mass into a force? So that will be Newton's second law. 
So, we'll multiply mass by acceleration. So, with this analogy, we could uh, say that G is acceleration. But what type of acceleration? And that G is, it is known as the G is known as the acceleration due to gravity. So this is the acceleration due to gravity. So the value of G depends on the uh, unit or depends on the system unit. So for MKS that is 9.8066 meters per second squared. For this is for MKS. MKS for CGS that is equal to 980.666 centimeters per second squared. And for FPS we just put here. For FPS, that is equal to 32.2 feet per second squared. So, and that is now the, uh, the, the relationship between mass and grams, mass and no, mass and weight. So, our G is the acceleration due to gravity.